Everyone drinks them, everyone loves them. But what effect this gummy bear water actually has on the human body, few people know. Until now, of course. Let's go. Number five. A standard can of energy drink contains 250 milliliters. It has 80 milligrams of caffeine and 27.5 grams of sugar. That's equal to nine sugar cubes. After finishing the can, the pulse rises and so does the blood pressure. After 20 minutes, the first positive effects set in. You feel awake and powerful. After another 20 minutes, all the caffeine has entered your system. In addition, the sugar stimulates the brain and the happiness hormone, dopamine, is released. Now you have about an hour of use for the positive effects of the energy drink. After this, the fatigue starts to come back. Some people even believe that they're now more irritable and nervous than before they consumed the energy drink. These effects are stronger the more caffeine degrades into the body. Number 4. Experts agree. A can of energy drink a day is okay, but two is the absolute maximum that you should take in. The Federal Institute for Risk Assessment warns that especially for people with cardiovascular disorders, it can get really dangerous for more than two doses because the caffeine and the high sugar content can make the heart beat more rapidly. Some of the other common additives like taurine are not so serious. Taurine incidentally does not come from bull testicles, but rather it's an amino ethane sulfonic that evolves cysteine in the breakdown of the amino acid. According to the foundation, most additives like taurine funnily enough do not have any bad effects. They pretty much have no effect at all. It's all just marketing. Number three. Therefore, the only things left are the three basic ingredients, water, sugar, and caffeine. Especially in combination with alcohol or sports, these three ingredients can have devastating effects on our bodies. The Federal Institute for Risk Assessment warns that there's many health problems and even death. Number two. Although energy drinks give you the feeling of a boost of energy, the actual performance of the consumer does not rise. In 2010, researchers at Northern Kentucky University published a study in which they had to perform a reaction test on their subjects after consuming an energy drink. However, half of all the participants got a sweet drink without caffeine, instead of the usual energy drink. The result? The reactions of the people with caffeine were much poorer than those without. Altogether, energy drinks are certainly okay to drink, but one should definitely not overdo it. Although opinions differ widely, one major producer even claimed that no study has yet to show that effects are beyond that of a cup of coffee. Nevertheless, one should enjoy the drinks cautiously. And perhaps instead of keeping yourself artificially awake, you should just go to bed on time. Okay, well that's all the energy we have for you. Hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, why don't you go ahead and subscribe for more, or just check one out here. Until next time, see ya!